the Stoka Explory X for 2021. This is new and it's updated and I'm excited about showing you a full review in this video. We're gonna talk about the Stoka Pippa car seat that makes it work, work seamlessly as a travel system. I've used the original Explory with my third child, so this is a stroller that I actually used and it's really cool to see the, the evolution of the stroller. In fact, I'm gonna show you, break it down for you. It's a very unique design. The Explory is available to buy from us from Magic Beans with free shipping. So if you're looking for a full list of the best strollers to look at for 2021, go over to mbeans.com right now and download the stroller buying guide. And without further ado, here is the Stoka Explory X for 2021. All right, guys, we have the Stoka Explory X, the latest generation of Stoka Explory. Now, if you've been watching for a while, you know that this is unique because I actually is the last stroller I used for my third child. And I'm excited about telling you why I love it. It's pretty awesome. It's definitely unique. And so you may, may or may not like the look of the stroller. I happen to love it. It is all about family bonding. Cause as you can see this, even with the seat facing out, the seat is extremely high. This is one of the highest seats of any stroller that is out there. You can get up a baby Vista with the upper adapters and sort of like make that happen. But out of the box, this is going to be the highest seat. And that's something that parents really rarely think about. Let me show you how to turn the seat around. Um, there is this very generous footrest, which I'm gonna talk, what I'm gonna talk about in a second. You pick up the seat and then you just like loop it through the handlebar and you click it on. Don't worry the looping, it is super, super easy. But now the baby is so close to you. So when you're walking around in your neighborhood, through the shopping mall, if we go back to malls, um, and you will be able to bond with your baby, talk to the baby. If you are familiar with the Stoka Trip Chap High Chair, which is like their iconic, like original product, it's about family bonding, bring the child to the table, talk to the child, interact with the child. Same thing goes with the stroller, the Explory X. You're gonna walk around the neighborhood and be close to the baby. So when you're shopping for strollers, take a look. How far away is the baby from you when you're trying it out? It's that's some, not something that everyone thinks about. They think about like other factors, about the weight and other functionalities of the stroller. But for this stroller, if you want a stroller where you can like really bond with the baby, this is the one to get. Um, if you looked at the last generation Explory, they had a different footrest, but they went back to the original styling of footrest, but it's optimized to be larger, more generous. Again, back to that Stoka DNA of footrests. And when you're stopping for strollers, think about where are your ch child's feet going to rest, right? You're gonna be walking around all day. If their feet are dangling, they're not going to be so comfortable. As they get bigger, are they going to be comfortable? So with this, you can simply, by just squeezing a little button below the footrest, you can move it up and down as your child gets bigger, and you can have your child comfortably lean their feet on the footrest. Very easy to maneuver, very comfortable for the child. They'll complain less when they're in the stroller. That's a great thing. Talking about as your child gets older, there's a 48 pound weight limit on this thing. 48 pounds, that's like a, four-year-old, a five-year-old, they are going to be out of the stroller by then. So you don't have to worry about like maxing out this thing. And you can add a sort of a ride on board with it, which I can show you a little bit later in the video. Stay tuned. Now, they, in terms of the seat materials and the textiles, it's all made from 100% recyclable material. So vehicle friendliness is, this sounds overly salesy today. I, I don't know why. I'm sorry. This is not my intention, but I'm just like, I know, I just went into sales mode, sorry about that. But let, let's let's just keep trying to do this in a way that's just, just, I just wanna tell you about everything. I just want you to know, want you to love it like I love it. That's what's going on here. I apologize in advance. So new insert, new insert, super plush and cushy. So what you can do is you adjust the stroller, then you put your thumb on, a thumb thing, and you push it in and you can move it all the way back. And now I have your baby as a newborn right here in the actual seat. You can also get a bassinet for this and click it in as a bassinet if you want a whole bassinet situation. It's really, really lovely. Um, but if you wanted to get just a normal stroller out of the box, under $1,000 this time, by the way, you can, 
well, just about $1,000, you can uh, put the baby right in the super, super soft and plush infant insert, which is like easily removable, again, for that 48 pound big child. So like, again, grows with the child and all of that stuff. So nice eco-friendly story with the uh, recyclable material. And actually it's super soft. It's very silky. I really lo I, I love it. And it is, um, um, UPF 50, so it's sun, um, sun protecting and it is rain, rain repellent. So that's what this um, canopy could do as well. Keep talking about the canopy. There is a reflector, a light reflector here, so it's safer to walk around at night and you can unzip it. I think this is actually pretty cool and total awesome air ventilation. Total awesome air ventilation and a giant window to watch your baby as you're walking around with a baby. So that is a very cool thing. Look how breezy, if you live in a hot climate and you're worried about the baby getting hot, very, very cool. You will zip this back up. Nice changing bag on the bottom, or like instead of a basket, they have this bag, which is very cool. And again, really high, um, but also you can make it low. This is another thing. You could bring this to, and I, um, I used to do this with, when I had the stroller. You could bring it to the restaurant with you. Um, when we go back to restaurants and you can take, if you're watching this, I'm doing this at the, towards the middle to end of the pandemic. That's why I keep saying, if you go to restaurants, you may be watching this a couple years from now. There was a pandemic in 2020, 2021, if you didn't know that. Okay, click it back in. And then you can adjust it to be lower. So you just pull out this um, adjuster on the bottom here and you can adjust the seat lower. So now you're in the lower position. So if you went to a restaurant, like I was saying, you can sit the seat, the chair up, lower the handlebar down, and push the seat to the table, and you don't have to get some sort of dingy high chair from the restaurant. You can literally push your baby straight up, or if the baby's sleeping, when you walk, into the restaurant and then they wake up, all you have to do is choose just the, adjust the stroller and it actually can like double as a high chair in a restaurant. Don't have to like put it someplace and that's I think a pretty cool, convenient and unique thing about this stroller. Um, in terms of the handlebar, since I'm touching the handlebar, um, it is easy access, one of those easy access handlebars, which is really great. Um, and there's a leather red handle, um, belly bar and, um, and handlebar for the parent or the caregiver. Uh, let's talk about the, um, the ergonomics of this thing. So this is very, very height adjustable. Um, I'm five foot 11, this is very high. If you're a tall human being, um, like the Norwegian, like this is a Norwegian based um, brand, this can go to at least six feet. But if you are a very petite person, you can lower this um, very low. In fact, I remember my kids are, I had like two older-ish kids. It was like, I had a six, a four-year-old and a newborn. That was like the spacing of my children. And I remember when I had my son, who was my little one, we used to have the kids push the stroller. Pro tip from a parent, have the kids push the stroller. So you can like lower this down and literally have, is that safe? It, it seems safe to me, I can make my own decision. So we had the kids push it around. And if you're sort of a petite, petite person, you can just lower this handlebar to really any position you want. So it's neat because you can adjust the seat, you can adjust the handlebar and have all of these different options for your child. Let's talk about folding the thing. So there's a little loop right here and a little, butt, a little pull that you pull. So you pull it down, pull the loop, and then you put your foot on the Explore logo, on the Stoker logo, and you push that forward. So that is going to enable you to actually put this in an escalator mode or a stair mode. So when it's in this two wheel position, you can like go up and down stairs or up and down escalators, which I think is really um, neat. I would highly recommend you use an elevator, but um, you can do this. I mean, when we go, like when we walk around our area in Brookline, there are a bunch of like just like three stairs or four steps that you have to like go up and down or even just cur curbs. It's just so easy to move the Explory into stair mode and just bop up and down, super, super easy. And then what you can do is you can just lower the handlebar and just put it down to the ground. And when you put it into the car, you may want to remove the seat, you don't have to, remove the seat and put it in this position for a more um, compact 
situation. But um, this is a big, let me I'm gonna watch to the end. I have a pro tip that I want to share with you, but um, let's talk about this in travel system mode. So you remove the seat and now you just have the actual frame. So when your baby's first born, maybe you just take your Explory frame and bop it into the car. You just pull the loop and you pop the wheels out. Okay, I have here a Stoka Nuna Pippa. So this is a Nuna Pippa, but it is made for Stoka, specifically for the Explory. And so it has many of the same features of a Nuna Pippa. Um, after this, I'll put a link to, below to a other review of a Nuna Pippa, so you can see a full review of the Nuna Pippa. Um, but it is just like a Nuna Pippa, but let me show you how it works on the actual stroller. So I'm actually gonna raise this back up. You can see that adjuster now that the seat is off. You remove it from the base. There's a little white pull here. And you just take this and you can click it right into the stroller. So again, even as a travel system, nice and high, you're talking, you're interacting with the child, about eight pounds, no adapter. You don't need to have an adapter, but if you have a regular Pippa or a Klek Ling or any other Maxi Cozy type compatible car seat, they do make adapters for that as well. Um, so great uh, Pippa. Um, the things that's unique about this, um, the Stoka Pippa variety of it, is um, really nice bright white um, touch points for things that move, which is good to know. Um, there is no dream drape on the Stoka Pippa, so that's something to uh, note, but there is a just a very nice sun visor right here, which you can pop in and out. There is, similar to the Explory, there is a very lovely um, ventilated, a ventilated uh, canopy to the stroller, so uh, to the car seat, so the air can breeze through. Again, in the summer, in warmer climates, that is really nice. Leatherette handlebar as well. And then you just push these two buttons and you remove it and put it back into the base. Um, very quickly, base has a load leg, um, rigid latch that enables you to easily just click in, like if you're installing the, the base, you just, oops, you just click it in in two seconds. Now, if you know this, in 2020, Nuna came out with a relaxed base. So the base for the Pippa, Stoka Pippa, is the original base. But I have a relaxed base here, and I'll show you that the Stoka Pippa can work on the relaxed base. So again, you just pull this right out. It takes a second. Here is the relaxed base. Um, it has that very extra adjustable load leg for extra connection point, extra safety. Um, it has this anti-rebound plate, which is good for anti-rebound, but the most sort of um, important feature or the most notable feature is it has a adjustable base to position your child correctly in the car. So to remove the Stoka Pippa from the Explorer, you push these two buttons on the side and you click it right into the relaxed space. So, even though you or might be buying a Stoka Pippa for your Explory to use it without the um, to use it without the adapter, you can buy an additional relaxed space um, for your for a second car, or you can replace the original base that comes with the Pippa with a relaxed space. Um, if you want, this is a perfect time for me to um, suggest that you talk to one of our amazing consultants at Magic Beans. You can. Email us at questions at mbs.com or you can book a consultation at mbs.com slash consultations where we will talk about everything I just said a lot slower or you can just rewind the video and watch that again. So relax space, regular base is very co confusing. I'm also gonna be doing a full Pippa, what's the deal with the Nuna Pippa video um, on the channel, so subscribe today. Let's just quickly talk about the, um, the ride on board because it's really neat. Okay, this is called a sibling board uh, for a sibling. And what you do is you attach it right here to the back. Very easy to push around. Um, they make it so that it is sort of tapered in. So when you're walking, if you have to take a long walk, you 
don't, you don't like walk on the sibling board. But the neat thing is about this particular sibling board, this is very smart. Right here on the back where you sort of close the stroller, that is a, a, a there's a magnet happening. So when the, you're not using, like let's say you drop the sibling off at preschool or daycare or something like that, just pull the thing up and it's magnetized and you don't have to walk around with it or take it off altogether. It's a really, really elegant way of storing the sibling board, which I think is really neat. Stoka also came out with this great changing bag, a diaper bag. It has a number of cool features. Number one, you could hang it on the back of the Explorer for extra storage. You can use it as a backpack. You can also um, use this as an over the shoulder bag. Really nice to, um, to accompany the Explorer. But like I said, I promised you a pro tip. Okay, here's your pro tip. This is not a, a Stoka product, this is a Baby Zen yo-yo. You may be watching this video and thinking to yourself, hey Ellie, I know you say that this is like very easy to fold, but it seems kind of big. I don't, I have a very small trunk. Uh, this is like not the stroller for me. Um, that may be true for an Explorer, but it's probably also true for a Bugaboo Fox or an Upper Baby Vista or a Cybex Premium or all of these other strollers that you may be looking at in addition, um, like while you're looking at the Explorer as well. So what I recommend to you, and I recommend to all parents, is to get two strollers. You get this big stroller for walking around the neighborhood, for extra comfort for baby, but then in terms of like travel or throwing something easy into the car, again, whether it's an Explorer or a Vista, you want something just really light and convenient for the car. You may not get that from day one, but I guarantee you as a parent of three and someone who's helped thousands of parents, most people get at least two strollers. You get your Explorer for the home, right? With a nice seat in the plush situation. And then you get your yo-yo. For the car. And you have your two strollers, you have your house stroller and your car stroller. Um, if you like this video, please give it a like. And if you wanna see more videos like these, please subscribe today. And unfortunately, this stroller just came out, so it isn't in my roundup of my best strollers of 2021 video, but that has many, many, like dozens of strollers, and I recommend that you watch that video right after this one. And I will see you at the next video. Thanks for watching.